Hello everyone, my name is Yiwen Chen. I'm going to introduce our work Video Silent Object Detection via Contrastive Features and Attention Modules. This is a joint work with Xiao Jiejin, Xiao Huishen, and Ming Xuan Yang. The goal of Video Silent Object Detection is to find the most visually attractive regions in each frame of a video. The challenging part of this task is to distinguish the primary object in from the background and efficiently model the temporal information. The motivation of this work is that previous methods usually use optical flow or comp LSCM to model temporal information, which are computationally expensive. To reduce the computational cost, we integrate contrastive learning into our model, which can improve intra-frame discriminability and inter-frame consistency. Also, one of the limitations of CN-based models is that convolutional operation processes only one local neighborhood at a time. To, over to overcome this issue, we propose the non-local self-attention to capture long-distance dependencies and the cross-level co-attention to integrate low-level and high-level features. Here is the pipeline of the proposed framework. The feature of the input image is first extracted by an encoder. Then we apply a non-local self-attention module on the feature X. In addition, a cross-level co-attention module is applied on the low-level feature V and the high-level feature X. The two attention features are then weighted by a gating function. Finally, the original feature X, self-attended feature, and co-attended feature are concatenated and fed into the detection head to generate the output saliency map. To learn better feature representations, we apply contrastive learning on the features before the final output layer. Then I will talk about the details of each module. For the non-local self-attention, we compute the relationships between any two positions in the input frame. The non-local operation contains a pairwise function and a unary function. The output is then wrapped into a non-local block with a residual connection. In this work, we adopt a lightweight non-local block where the feature transformations are shared and the one-by-one -one convolution is replaced with a 3 by 3 depth-wise convolution. In the cross-level co-attention module, we integrate edit details from low-level features and semantic meaning from high-level features. Specifically, we compute affinity matrix A from the low-level feature V and high-level feature X, and then generate the co-attention feature from A and X. In the contrastive feature learning, for each anchor as the foreground region of the input frame, we select positive samples as foreground regions from the other frame, from other frames of the same video and negative samples as background regions from the same or other frames. We then apply the contrastive flaws as shown below. In this work, we use DeepLab V3 as the vitric encoder and we conduct experiments on the Davis FEMS VESO and Dave SOD datasets. For the evaluation metrics, we adopt F measure, MAE, and S measure. Here we show the experimental results of the video selling object detection. Our method achieves the best performance in all datasets. Here are the experimental results of video object segmentation on the Davis datasets. We also show that the proposed method outperforms existing approaches. Here we provide the comparisons with self-the-art methods on computational complexity. Our method requires less number of parameters, flops, and runtime. Here are some sample results of saliency detection on the Davis dataset. The results by our method are more accurate and contain more details. We also show the segmentation results on the Davis dataset. To conclude this work, we propose a non-local self-attention operation that captures long-distance correspondence and we design a cross-level co-attention formulation to explore the correspondence between low-level and high-level features. Furthermore, we integrate the contrastive learning techniques into our network to learn features with better intra-frame discriminability and inter-frame consistency. We achieve self-the-art performance with higher accuracy, smaller model size, and lower computational complexity.